Hello everyone. I am Kunika and I will be your e-pedagogue for the subject of science. Students, today what we are going to learn is very special but also requires us to be very cautious. You heard me right students. This is chapter number 14 when the earth shook. As the name suggests, it is about shaking. but not some minimal shaking or not some person shaking but our entire earth shaking i am sure students you must have had an idea about what we are going to learn we are going to learn about a few natural calamities wo cheeze bachcho jo nature ke through aati hain but they cause a lot of destruction so let us look at this story and find out what we have to know about it a bad dream Help help save me ah oh there was screaming and shouting everywhere the ground was shaking and people were running all around screaming loudly i got up on hearing me my mother also woke up she came running and helped me tied it was the same bad dream it has been more than 6 years now since the earthquake but in my sleep i still feel the earth shaking and trembling I am Jasma. I live in the Kutch area of Gujarat. I was 11 years old when there was an earthquake. तो बच्चों ये स्टोरी है हमारी ही जैसी एक लड़की जसमा की जो कच्छ एरिया में रहती है इन गुजरात Every now and then it's been 6 years when she's been having the same repetitive dream about the very severe earthquake. students let me remind you that this earthquake was very very severe and a lot of destruction took place since jasma was just a child she was 11 years old she is traumatized and felt so bad about the earthquake that now she has been having dreams about the same let us look at her story and see why she feels like this in 20 it was 26th january 2001 Everyone from the village, children and old people had gathered in the ground of the school to watch the parade on TV. Suddenly the ground was shaking. People were scared and started running here and there. No one knew what was happening and what to do. There was total panic. So she tells us that on 26th January 2001 Everybody was gathered around to have to watch the parade on TV but what they saw suddenly was the ground shaking i'm sure students some of you must have seen or experienced an earthquake it comes from the ground and everything around us starts to shake that is what the entire village felt it was a total panic in a few minutes our village was flat on the ground All our things, clothes, pots, grains, and food were trapped under the stones, mud, and wood from the fallen houses. At that time, everyone thought of two things: to save the people who were trapped and to treat the injured. The village hospital was also damaged. Many people were seriously injured. My leg also got fractured. The doctor treated people with the help of the villager. So, students, as soon as the earthquake shook them. they were very scared a lot of the people were trapped a few of them were injured but what their strategy was based on two things to help people to save them and to treat to those who are saved to bachcho jab bhi koi earthquake aata hai koi bhi natural calamity aati hai based on the areas we live in our approach should be to help people and also help ourselves jitna zyada aap dusro ki madad kar sake while keeping yourself safe you should do that let us see what happened in their village the doctor treated people with the help of villagers so the doctor tried and started to treat people with the villagers six people of our village died my grandfather was also buried under the houses my mother wept all the time seeing my mother i also cried the entire village was sad and disturbed house of mota bapu was who is the sarpanch of our village was not much damaged he gave rice and wheat to everyone from his godown for many days the village women cooked food together at mota bapu's house and fed everyone Imagine being without a house in the cold winter. Fear and the cold kept us awake in the nights. All the time we were worried and there may be another 
earthquake so students as the as jasma tells us about their experience ki kaise unke ghar mein unke ghar ke aas paas sare hi ghar niche aa gaye the there were people trapped her grandfather also died which made her mother so so sad that she kept weeping so did she students whenever we lose someone we fear that we might lose someone else and there is a loss in our hearts that is what the entire village felt और दो जो उनके सरपंच थे मोटा बापू उनका घर इतना ज़्यादा डैमेज नहीं हुआ है नहीं हुआ था इसी वजह से उन्होंने सबको फूड ग्रेन्स जैसे राइस और वीट प्रोवाइड करे और बहुत टाइम तक बच्चों विलेज की सभी लेडीज ने सभी लोगों ने मिलकर ही काम करा जिससे उन्हें थोड़ा सिक्योर भी लगे फ्रॉम अनदर अर्थ क्विक इफ देयर माइट बी एंड टू ऑल्सो प्रिजर्व देयर रिसोर्स एंड फीड वन अनदर students this is what is required whenever a calamity is struck is struck we are supposed to help ourselves and others we are supposed to remain together and secure each and every one's well being discuss and write have you or anyone that you know ever faced such difficulty who all helped us such a time make a life students i'm sure you must have been knowing or heard in some news report or on some article in the news make sure to write your own answers if you have experienced some calamity i remember in the last year 2020 there were so many earthquakes and based on our drills my father helped us to get out of our houses in a, in an open area students make sure you write your own experiences and make a list of who all helped you help arise from for some days after that people from the cities kept coming to see what had happened they came with food medicines and clothes everyone used to rush to take these things the clothes that we got were very different we had never worn such clothes before people from different groups from the city helped us to put up the tents staying in these प्लास्टिक टेंस इन द कोल्ड विंटर मंथ्स वॉज वेरी डिफिकल्ट तो अब वो बताते हैं बच्चों कैसे उनके पास हेल्प आती है तो हेल्प में उनके पास बहुत सारा फूड रिसोर्स होता है जो वेरियस ऑर्गेनाइजेशन प्रोवाइड करती होंगी और बहुत सारे ऐसे कपड़े क्योंकि बहुत ज़्यादा ठंड थी जनवरी के महीने में तो बहुत सारे ऐसे कपड़े जो उनके हेल्प कर सके बट दे फेल्ट सो ऑड एंड सो स्ट्रेंज वेयरिंग दो स्पोर्ट्स क्योंकि उन्होंने कभी ऐसे कपड़े पहने ही नहीं थे इसके साथ साथ वो हमें ये भी बताती हैं कि कैसे इन टेंट्स में इतनी सर्दी में रहना बहुत मुश्किल था क्योंकि घर तो सारे गिर गए थे तबाह हो गए थे ड्यू टू द डिस्ट्रक्शन कॉज बाय दी अर्थ क्वेक तो अब उन्हें टेम्परेरली टेंट्स में रहना पड़ रहा था सम ऑफ दीज पीपल व साइंटिस्ट दे ट्राई टू फाइंड आउट विच एरियाज हैव चांसेज ऑफ हैविंग एन अर्थ क्वेक अगेन people from our village talked to them many times they had suggestions about building our houses again engineers and architects showed us some special designs for houses they said that with this design houses would not get damaged much in an earthquake but our people were a little afraid they thought if these people build our houses our village will not look like our old village so the villagers thought they would bring their own houses with their help the groups would build the village school to bachcho jaise jaise unke paas help aayi unhone dekha ki ab bahut sare log aa rahe the jaise ki kuch scientists kuch engineers kuch architects aur wo sab iste aa rahe the taki wo village ki help kar sake to scientists ye study karke bata sakte the ki kaun se aise areas hain jo abhi bhi prone hai to earthquakes whereas engineers aur architects unke ghar ko rebuild karne mein help kar sakte the in a way ki ab koi earthquake aaye ya koi bhi natural calamity ho to itna zyada damage na ho but villagers who had been living in the same houses for so long felt ki agar wo rebuild kar lenge apne gharon ko to unka village unke pehle wale village jaisa nahi rahega but make sure students that we remind ourselves here that this was the need of the hour this was very important to protect all of us villagers thought that they would build their own own houses but the group would build the school so that is what they planned for it we all work together to rebuild our village some people dug and brought the clay from the pond we mixed the clay with cow dung and made large cakes we put these on one another to make the walls we whitewashed the walls and decorated them with beautiful designs and small pieces of mirrors we put up the thatched roof roof 
now our houses shine like a diamond in the dark night so students ab wo batate hain ki kaise villagers ne socha tha ki wo apne ghar ko milke banayenge waise hi wo ye sab start karte hain by rebuilding they for the process of rebuilding they get their clay they mix it in the pond they mix it with the cow dung to make a batter jisse wo ghar bana sake usi ke sath sath wo decoration mein bhi bahut zyada help karte hain bachcho by pasting some mirrors but one important thing that we mention that they mention here is they put up the thatched roof yani ki wo roof jo already toot chuki hoti hai usko wapas rebuild karne mein it takes a lot of effort but now their house shines like anything like a bright star in the dark night let us discuss these few questions a lot of people from other places came to jasma's village who were these people in what ways would they have helped the villagers so they brought a lot of food clothes medicines etc as we saw scientists also came they wanted to identify areas prone to getting earthquakes they also wanted to build damaged houses with the help of engineers and architects so i have listed a few reason make sure you read the chapter by yourself again and find out few more reasons people in jasma's village rebuilt their houses with suggestions from the engineers will these houses be safer than before in case there is an earthquake again why so students this time the houses were built with the help of architects and engineers so definitely it will be safer because the engineers suggestion to rebuild the houses will make them safe in order to build a house you need some professional guidance students aur yahi guidance unhe various engineers aur architects se mili to isliye agar kabhi by chance koi financial calamity fir se hoti hai i am sure there won't be much damage think if for an earthquake where you live would you be would your house be in danger definitely students if we live in any place and there is a earthquake of very large magnitude yani ki bahut zyada jo destruction kar sakta hai to bahut tarike ki destruction ho sakti hai bachcho it can also cause another calamity such as fire और जैसे कि हमने देखा उनकी रूफ भी को लैप्स हो गई थी दैट इज़ वन सच वेरी कॉमन फिनोमिना बन देज एन अर्थ क्वे कि जिस भी जगह हम होते हैं अगर हम किसी क्लोज जगह के अंदर हैं वो नीचे को लैप्स कर जाता है वॉट विल यू डू टू सेव पेट एनिमल्स ड्यूरिंग नेचुरल डिजास्टर्स स्टूडेंट्स वी आर ह्यूमन्स एंड वी हैव द एबिलिटी टू गो आउट एंड सेव आर सेल्स बट एनिमल्स पेट्स हु आर वेरी स्केयर एट दीज टाइम्स नीड सम केयर एंड रेस्क्यू टू हेल्प दैम सो मेक श्योर बाय मेकिंग योर सेल्फ सेफ यू ऑल्सो हेल्प द एनिमल्स अराउंड यू